What up, though? I'm Fat. I'm Trey. Welcome back to another edition of Fast, Fast and Tree. Today, what we're going to talk about is things that people do on their cruise. Stick around towards the end, and we do have a bonus tip. First up, we're going to talk about is the cabin crawl. The cabin crawl is something that you go around and you check out other cabins before everybody fills the ship up, or even go to a cabin of a friend that might have a different type of cabin that you have. So you can see the different designs in the cabins. They also do it when you're going like to your room and they have the um, rooms open, the stewarder. Mm -hmm. And you can say, oh, like, can I check out the ocean view room? Mm -hmm. Sometimes they'll let you do it. So you want to do the cabin crawl so you can have an idea of what the inside of each cabin looks like because when you go into a different category of the cabins they are very the layout is very different next up what we're going to talk about is called the bar crawl that's something that everybody likes the bar crawl because when you're on the ship you want to check out different types of alcohol that each bar can make for you mm -hmm. each bar is different Every believe it or not I didn't believe that. When I first started cruising, I was like, really? I thought that they served everything on each bar the but same they thing. They don't. They don't. The Alchemy Bar is the one of the top bars on there, and they pretty much can make anything you ask them to make. Specialty drinks or a drink that you had on another ship, they'll try to make it. Or a drink you got in your mind. They can put it together. Yes. The Casino Bar, another place. That one, they'll try to make it, or they always have, you could say, what's the special for today? They'll get it for you. Mm -hmm. Then you have the Red Frog. Red Frog. They have totally different things in there. Mm -hmm. They even have the- The uh, Punch Bowl. The, uh, the uh, ja ja Jamaican. They have the Punch Bowl alcohol where they uh, mix different types of drinks in there. It's mm -hmm. a real big punch bowl. Try that. And they two people can drink, drink off it at once. Then they have the um, beer sampler. Beer sampler. Different types of My favorite. carnival beers. And they'll sample it. And they'll tell you what beer is which one. And they will give you a write-up on all of them. Check that out as well. That is at the Red Frog. On the inside. Yes. Not on the outside. So the inside of the Red Frog and the outside of the Red Frog are different. Are different. They serve different things. Mm -hmm. So that's why we say, try to do a bar crawl and just go to the different bars and check out what they have to offer. You'll be surprised. Mm -hmm. We did that on our last cruise. We went from bar, 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 and we had a good time. We had a good check time. Check it out. Be the door decoration. You have to be a birthday or a celebration. You can just decorate your door. You can buy things. You can order it on Amazon. You can buy things from the dollar store on the way on. Or you can order some things. I think the ship also sell things that you can put on your door to decorate your door. Put your name up there, the anniversary. It could be anything special or anything you want it to be, and they will put it on that door. Or yes. you can put it on that door. Yes. And you can go to carnival.com and buy those things, like you say, Amazon, whatever. Also, cabin decorations. People do cabin decorations. Mm -hmm. um, they get carnival to decorate, and once you get them to do it, once you get there, it's already done. So you just walk into a cabin that's already decorated, already real nice, all that. And so, if it's your birthday, it's going to have it on the door. Yes. You write your name, happy birthday, Ronald McDonald. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so next is cruising ducks. Mm. A lot of people use the cruising ducks for their YouTube handles, mm -hmm. putting their channel out Facebook there, channel. everything. And then a lot of cruisers like to find them. So if you see them um, all around the ship, take a picture, put it on cruising ducks website on Facebook. Mm -hmm. Let them know you found the cruising duck on the Carnival Horizon. They love it. Mm -hmm. We do it every time we go, and we love looking at pe people be so excited about uh, finding, finding all the those duck. ducks. Even the people that work on it be also be excited, too. Because that's a tradition. Yes. So, 
again, if you find a cruising duck, go ahead and take a picture with this. Say you found one and put it on cruising ducks on their Facebook page. Next, we're going to talk about learning the cruise lingo, the language of the cruise. Learn it. Because you're going to need it. When you start cruising a whole, whole lot mm -hmm. and somebody asking you different things like ship, boat, you know, you're going to have to know the lingo or language of the cruise. And most of it starts with that elevator. Mm -hmm. The names are in the elevator. Yes. On each floor is where it all starts at. Yeah. So just look at it. You'll have a good time with it. Next People go on the ships to do slot pools. Slot pools. A lot of times when you know you're going on a different sailing and you've joined the Facebook page, they will have a slot pool competition and they'll ask you, do you want to participate? You meet up in the um, casino at a certain time doing your um, selling mm -hmm. and y'all take turns and whoever win, sometimes they win the whole jackpot. So be on the lookout for slot pools. Next up, we're gonna be like the meetup on the ship. Like if you had a Facebook page that you were participating in, already discussed, we're gonna all meet up here at the Red Frog. We might, they might exchange a uh, keychain. They might exchange some type of gift, but that's where the meetup normally be at the Red Frog. And you get to meet some of the people that you were communicating back and forth with on Facebook. And those are good. They have different types of um, gift exchanges. They have shot glasses. Shot glasses, yeah. They have um, keychains. They have um, magnets. Magnets, yeah. Yeah, they have all kinds of different things. And they tell you, design it the way you want, and then you just pass them out. Mm -hmm. Put whatever you want on You can customize them. Or you can buy the one that's from your airport or something mm -hmm. that says where well, whatever state or city you're from, that's what you bring as your gift exchange. And they'll know, well, oh, I got this from Ronald. He's from Washington, D.C. Because that's what mine's going to say. So. Next, when you're booking your cruise, try to look at some of the theme cruises. We've took a lot of those, mm -hmm. and they are good cruises. For example, Halloween. Mm -hmm. Valentine's Day, St. Patrick's Day, Christmas, mm -hmm. New Year's. Thanksgiving. You know, they are good themed cruises. Mm -hmm. So when you're on Carnival.com and you say, I want to do a theme cruise, they're good to do because the ship does do different activities that involves the theme that's coming up. So if you have a Christmas, they'll say, okay, wear ugly sweaters contests, you know, your Christmas pajamas. There's a lot you can do on the ships when it's time for the themes. So look out for those. Up is gonna be what? Group cruises. Group cruises. Those are good to meet different people. There are a lot of groups that Facebook and Instagram and YouTube groups that are forming a lot of group cruises. Mm -hmm. So take a look at them and see. They are real nice. You get to meet a lot of people. People that you've been talking to via on months. YouTube and all that. And mm -hmm. then you finally get to meet them. That is an awesome thing. Mm -hmm. So try to do some of the group cruises because you meet so many different nice people. We have met a lot of people. Mm -hmm. We met a lot of people. At least in the last, since the summer, we met, met at least a at least 100 people are better. Yeah, because once you go on a cruise, you'll meet them. Mm -hmm. If they don't know about you, if you have a YouTube content creator and they don't know about you, put your name out there. Let mm -hmm. them know who you are. Yep. They will be happy to meet you. The bonus tip of today is download the Carnival Hub app. Download mm -hmm. that Carnival Hub app. Gotta and we it. tell you that because that's the number one thing. It's very important to have that down, to download that app. Don't wait until you get on the ship and try to download it and come to find out you can't download it because you waited too late. So now you got to go down there in that long line that we, we've been telling you in previous video, don't waste all your time down at that service desk. Yes. So, so if you sure. like this video, give us a thumbs up. Let us know how we're doing. 
Share us out. Give us a comment. Just at say the bottom something. of this really video, fun. we're going to have our Amazon link, store link. Mm -hmm. And check it out. Check out the t shirts. Check out the Cruise Essentials. Check out everything. It's right down there for you. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank y'all. Peace, love, cruising.